Well, good morning, everyone. How are we? We've got <laughs> these two just walking into each other, <laughs> winning it, Vito. We've got Timber out here. What else we've got? We've got Frank down here, just running the course over on his over on his own. And then, of course, we've got Lars, who also has just found a little niche directly behind me and seems to be enjoying himself. And, uh, you know, we're down on the water. It's, uh, we're over by, like, the legal and whatever this restaurant is that I can never remember. When I first moved to Boston, I had, I was, like, you know, like, 21 or something like that, and I had only really served tables in any kind of, well, I guess I cooked for a number of years, um, but uh, I'd only really served tables up, like, recently, up until that point of me moving here. And uh, I tried to get a job at that steakhouse, and they were like, you don't have any fine dining experience. And I was like, what are you talking about? I totally have fine dining experience. And they were like, not as fine as our establishment. And I was like, damn. Uh, okay. <laughs> so, next time you're at that steakhouse. Oh, there we are. That's fun. I never point my camera over here. Uh, because uh, almost every time I walk around here... No, nope, we're not peeing on glass. Almost every time we walk around here, this restaurant is completely full up for lunch. And uh, I do everything in my power not to look at the people <laughs> staring at me because, you know, you walk by with a group of dogs and they're all, you know, everybody looks and everybody's interested. Everybody points. Uh, you know, it's a, it's a bit ridiculous sometimes. But, uh, yeah, anyway, we're having, <laughs> we're having a nice time. I think we're going to walk over towards Harpoon. Uh, I like walking over there. There's like um, some side streets that I like walking down over there, which aren't like, you know, picturesque, but I like it. <laughs> I like it because it's like, whoa, crazy. That truck almost took out a, a car. Wow, that was wild. Um, anyway. I was about to say it. I like it because of indi like I like to see the industry um, down here. But uh, <laughs> come on, guys, let's go. Let's go find ourselves some industry to get honked at. So <laughs> it is really constructiony down here today. By the way, um, between all of the streets that are closed off to and like you know all the road work getting done and all the buildings getting built it took like twice as long to pick this group up as it should have that was crazy how long it took uh so yeah anyway <laughs> we're just having a day uh so i'm gonna do some damage to my audiobook that i've been listening to i uh i'd started a book called lincoln uh by gore vidal uh in december last year and then uh <laughs> last year, last month, a couple days ago. Um, but uh, I kind of like over the holidays took like a basically like a three week break on it. But it's like, you know, a 30 hour book. So it just takes a long time. And I only listen to it like three hours at a time. So we're taking small chunks out of it. But by the end of today, I should be down to about 12 hours. And then I'll finish this baby up next week. So, uh, you know, uh, yeah, let's go. Yeah, let's go this way, guys. Come on. So, <laughs> I'm finding it kind of hard to get into this Gore Vidal book. I really like Gore Vidal a lot, but this one, for some reason, is just... Uh, I don't know. Maybe it's because this is the fourth book in the last year that I'm reading about either the Civil War, Grant, or Lincoln. Um, so maybe I just have... Maybe I just have Civil War fatigue or Lincoln fatigue. Who knows? But and it is good. I'm just like, ugh the same thing all over again. So, uh, maybe it is just fatigue. Well, anyway, I'm sure this video is fatiguing for all of you. So I'll let you go. <laughs> Enjoy your days and uh, we'll talk to you soon. All right, bye.